a few Valentine's Day items here. Even there's a little red truck sign still. I just want to take a peek. Looks like they're doing a transition over to spring or Easter. But there are a few little new pieces here as well. I think these are new. Oh, they are. Aren't they cute? Some of you are asking if I could film some of the garden decor. So it looks like they have these new metal stakes. The little llama still kicking around. And then they have, oh, I wanted one of the little birds. So I'm going to have to grab one. But yeah, they have some tools up here and some of the rock, the little garden rocks and the clay pots. And some more little decor pieces here. They have like the tomato cage thingies and then they have a bunch of pots on this side here along with the full floor. If you need glassware, sometimes you'll find it along the bottom areas with their succulents here and then the full floral. And they have some really nice faux right now. Oh, these are cute. I like the way they have a little helium balloons attached to the stuffies throughout the store. It's cute. There's some Easter things here. So if you're looking for Easter treats, they already started putting them out. These are the Russell Stovers and then they have the generic stuff, but a few options and then some of the Valentine's Day things, but this will clear out pretty quick because now we're just around the corner from Valentine's Day. I think this is the first time I'm seeing the So Fresh So Clean signs. So this is fairly new to me, but again, I'm not in the stores as often, but they do have a bit of um, branding things for laundry as well. There's a movie sitting around here, but there's the snuggle. Oh, look how cute these are. So these are the Easter baskets, I guess, that are coming out. Little unicorn. There's pink, white, and it looks like there's purple in behind. Yeah, there's a purple one too. Super cute. Many of you love the LA's Totally Awesome Cleaner, but if you've noticed, this one here has a pump. It's a little spray bottle tip already included, which I think is pretty neat. And parchment paper is back in stock, so that's really super exciting, except I just bought two giant rolls at Costco because I couldn't wait any longer. So going forward, I know at least they're back. They have cute popcorn containers, which we like using. The Kleenex is still available, which is a great price here. And these are 15 oval, oval serving trays for $1.25. Super, super great if you... Um, maybe want to even donate to a homeless shelter or something like that they might be able to use them i'm not sure i gotta look into that these are great too for organizing in your drawers my daughter's birthday is creeping up on us so i like to always buy a thing or two here and there just so then i can decorate for her so i'm just looking to see if there's anything cute and they have some new birthday signs, which is, which is always nice. I always like adding a new piece here and there, and then I collect them over the years and then use them all at once. But there's always like something new. I'm just gonna go and look here at the party supplies. Not that I really need anything plastic from here, but I know that some of you guys appreciate when I walk down this aisle and share with you some of these items. Although I do love these little plates, the mini ones, the round ones. some new items here um, soap specifically I have not seen some of these before I think this one here I have so I bought a fountain like a little light up fountain pen type thing light up 
candle fountain. Ca fountain candle. These are cute balloons. They look like the big punch balloons when I was a kid. Oh, and they have some new latex ones. Anyways, I purchased that fountain candle and it was such a huge hit that I was hoping to find some for her birthday, but I haven't had luck the last couple times I've popped into Dollar Tree, so maybe I should visit another one, but maybe they sold out too. Oh, they have some new cups up top. LOL dolls. Some really awesome puzzles. If you're into puzzles, they Dollar Tree has had some amazing Disney puzzles. Like, look at these. There's the Little Mermaid. There's Mickey and Minnie and Moana. There are just a ton. There's even Frozen. I know that I've seen Frozen before. These are really cute. Like, if you want to challenge yourself, there's some really great difficult puzzles like such pretty puzzles and usually where the puzzles are you'll find like little card games or mini board games just different things to keep you busy as well I there's Doss the Express here like Uno I'll take a look at the organization, but it looks like they're a little bit low on stock here. Normally it's, there's so much more and I have a feeling there's some new organization that usually comes out in the spring. So I'll just have to keep my eyes peeled next time I come in. This is actually the first time I'm seeing the yarn with empty baskets. So normally it's fully stocked. So I guess somebody's come in and taking some of their inventory these are new little cotton pods three and a cat three count if you need moss I highly suggest buying it now because it will start to sell really quickly um, as soon as people start doing their spring Easter crafts they have a ton of jars. This one is a fairly new one, but it looks like it's sold out really quickly here. It could be readily available at different Dollar Trees. And then they have those regular vases up top that a lot of us are able to transform. These are new little notebooks. I know some of you are looking for notebooks for journaling, but I'm not sure if you're looking for blank pages or for ruled pages, but these are really cute. They're small though. I'll take a look down a little bit further down this stationary aisle. These are new as well. Dry erase magnetic clips. Few of you always request that I film the coloring books and it's somewhere I sometimes miss, so I'm trying to pay attention. They have some new coloring books here, which are the nice white pages. This one looks like a really pretty coloring book. You can also use these for wood burning onto pieces of wood, so they work as really great tracers. We'll check out the stickers here. I don't think they really have anything new or anything that's new to me because I always check the stickers. These are like, uh, I guess they're more like planner stickers. And then there's decorative stickers, of course. They have these little LOL sticker collections. They're so cute, but my daughter's kind of past this stage. I have never found a pack of three Sharpies at Dollar Tree before. I'm going to buy these for my daughter. She'll love them.
they're pretty well stocked in the cleaning supply stuff like the LA's totally awesome is fully stocked they have the dish detergent um, if I recommend any it's the blue wizard one which I've talked to you guys a few times in previous walkthroughs but yeah they're pretty the only thing I haven't seen in a while is a toilet bowl cleaner They have the little bags of flour and they have these little containers of cornstarch if you're needing any. And they are fully stocked with baking soda right now. They do have Arm & Hammer but it's a smaller package as you could see there. They have lots of baking things. Rice Krispies right now looks like it's the Christmas version and then they have these little frozen cookies. Lots of spices. They have the pasta that I like in the boxes, still fairly well stocked with some additional ones. And then these things here are new to me. I've never noticed them before. I'm not sure if anyone has any feedback on it, if it is tuna or not. I'll quickly walk down the craft aisle and these are fairly new. It looks like more of an Easter find. And then their canvases are quite limited right now. Just gonna go through some of the paints and see if there's anything new here. Paints are well stocked. You can see we have lots of white. I know that one was really popular for a while and they have a ton of paint brushes. I love these little crafter square paint palettes. Oh, the clear pony beads are back in stock. I haven't seen them here in a while. I still have to work with the couple that I purchased last time with the intention to do a DIY with my daughter. I also need to grab a couple more of these for organization in my craft room. So I just got to go through these and pick my favorite ones. There's the ones with the lids and these are kind of like a little cube and you can stack them on top of one another. They have, um, these are like performance shirts. So there's difference. There's some that are cotton, like these are, oh, the performance shirts, but there's like 100% cotton like these, and they're made by Gildan. So Dollar Tree has these new soaps. I don't know if anyone's used them. They're hands if you'd like. Maybe leave some feedback down below. And they also have new shower gel. So silk, silkins, silkins. They have the body wash. Ooh, L'Oreal. This looks promising. A mousse and Garnier Fructis. Wonder. So at the, on the end caps, they have these like new state setups where it's masks. These are new types of masks. They're a thicker washable one. And then they have these antibacterial mask case. So they have like blue and white and pink. Um, some are larger than others. So you can store your masks in these little containers. Just going to go through the makeup area. I know some of you guys really, this is a highly requested area of the store and one that I don't often spend that much time in. I do recommend if you have acrylics or do faux nails, this diamond fail, nail, nail file works really well. And they have a ton of e.l.f. products. They have these new little mirror and brush kits. Some new colors in the e.l.f. line. And just in there like LA's LA colors and there's usually another brand too oh Mariposa so yeah there's a few things here I'll go through them oh and they also have wet and wild nail polish Uh, 
Um, they have quite a bit of... I'm looking to replace one of my nail polishes that I really actually like by the... I don't know if it's Sassy and Chic or if it's their other line that they color. The, the line that they... Cosmic Colors? No, I don't think it was that either. I'll have to take a look when I get home. These are new little sponges. They're hanging in the kids, like the baby section, but I think that you could use them for anybody. Oh, these are sweet. Little security blankets, a little monkey, a little fox, and a little puppy. These are really cute. They're new. Kind of goes with the whole, they're really stepping up their game with the little baby department too. They had uh, Live Clean not too long ago, but it looks like those are all sold out, the baby wipes. If you're organizing your pantry or, you know, baked goods and things like that, Dollar Tree has quite the selection right now of glass storage. So I think it's worth taking a look if you need anything. They have different sizes as well. dishware like the farmhouse style how cute are their little stuffies this year I just love them and most of them don't even have you know like a sewn in button so they're super safe I've collected all of these when they first came out thinking they won't get restocked but here they are fully stocked so if anyone if anyone needs them to make little fairy gardens or to decorate little tiered trays, then you know where to find some cute things. I love a little teapot, it's so sweet. I don't think I've ever noticed KD, like there's family size and stuff like that at Dollar Tree. Now we don't buy craft dinner, but I think it's reasonably priced here. There's the S cookies that we love. And then I'm gonna grab some of these wheat thins because I think the price is right here. But yeah, the KD is really, Quite a great buy, I think. I haven't seen like cases of water in a very long time <laughs> at Dollar Tree. So, anyways, I um, wanted to see the little flowers before I head out because they have a ton of new spring floral, and there's some really pretty ones if you're making like wreaths or flower arrangements. And I'm just about to go to the checkout. Oh, and look, here at the checkout, there are these little candles that are so sweet. Look at these ones. Like, they look vintage or shabby chic. So cute. And they also have these ones here that are scented, it looks like. But anyways, I hope you guys... I was saying bye. I hope you guys enjoy walking through with me at Dollar Tree today. And I'm just going to head home. Until next time, everyone, I'm going to say bye for now.